Hey guys, so starting off with what I like to wear when I work out, I really like to wear sports bras and that one is just from Victoria's Secret. And then these are some really old, old, old shorts I got from Forever 21. And of course I gotta listen to my music. Then I just put on my socks and my shoes and I'm ready to go. First I have to listen to my 8 tracks playlist, Summertime Fitness, I just love this for working out. And then I like to put on a t-shirt over top of my sports bra because it just makes me feel more comfortable, especially if I'm going to go for a jog. And usually I like to jog in the morning around 40 minutes, just a light jog to get myself warmed up before I do any other exercises. Yep, I died. That was hard. <laughs> I like to lay out a yoga mat before I do any other exercises because it's more comfortable that way and I don't hurt myself. And then of course I drink some water. Now on to some abs. So I really like to start off with crunches because I just find they work my abs really well. You want to make sure that your back is as flat as possible against the floor because you don't want to risk arching and hurting yourself while you're doing these. So I just do 5 by 10 reps. That just means I do 10 crunches 5 times with a break in between usually around 30 seconds and then I do the same thing with my legs up in the air this really works the lower abs a lot and I do 5 by 8 reps this exercise really works the whole ab itself I really find it helps with my lower abs and my upper abs and I just really like it a lot and then I do the cobra stretch to stretch it all out afterwards Onto the thighs. So this is by far my favorite exercise to do ever. I just think it looks so funny, but it works really well. So I do three times 10 reps of this on one side, and then I switch over to the other side. You really want to make sure that you're squeezing the inner and outer thighs as you're going up and down, because that's going to work the best. This one works just the inner thigh, but I find it helps so much, and oh my gosh, does it ever burn. I usually just do two sets of 25 leg lifts and it works perfectly fine for me. This is like the funniest thing ever to watch, but seriously, this makes your butt burn like a crazy... I don't even know what word to say, just it, it hurts so bad, but it's so good. Now onto some simple squats. I just really find this works my butt and my legs and I really like doing them a lot. The proper way to squat is to pretend like you're sitting on a chair. You want to make sure that your knees are not going over your feet. Now onto my favorite part of the workout, the stretching. And this is so important after a workout. Trust me, you will not feel sore the next day. I find stretching helps so much. Plus it's just good for an everyday thing to be flexible. And I usually like to hold my stretches around 30 seconds each. This stretch is literally the best thing ever. I could honestly fall asleep. Oh, hey, look, I did. <laughs> now it's time to walk on your hands. Just kidding, don't do this if you don't know how. <laughs> I was just really hyper. And then I like to cool off in the pool. I was a swimmer for a long time, so I just feel like I'm one with the water. And it's just really comfortable after a good workout. <laughs> 